playoff here, yeah. yeah I can't okay. keep up with uh, these, these NASA puns. All right, they're going right into it. All right. I don't know why I'm saying they're going right into it, because they didn't go right into it earlier. But yeah, now they're going right into it. Ken gets that grab. Um, so I think uh, it's kind of tough. I would put Kira on um, Ken. I don't. I think Ken knows how to deal with Stab's uh, pressure. Okay. So, oh, like he has really raunchy setups. Ken yeah. Is. Like, 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 like that. Yeah. That's so like as in 2005. Is it? Yeah. He used to go for those spikes all the time. I thought you just sword smash. Maybe I'm thinking of husband. No, he would go for those uh, those down air tippers. Right. And this, um, yeah, that's a dead Marth, and, and Samus possibly. is probably living. This is going to be, for all, for all you viewers at home, this is going to be a similar type of setup. Samus is a character that is not easy to kill. You know, she's she's not necessarily a very combo-heavy character herself, but on the flip side, you can't combo her, and she's hard to kill. So you're going to see the same kind of situation where the Samus is going to live to really high percentage, just like that Luigi. Yeah. Um, and they will probably be getting kills a lot faster on the Marth. Yeah. I really like that, um, you know, they that Ken and Hugo took the lead and they didn't really like try to run around and get hit like they're playing impatiently right um, okay. I mean when you think running around and getting hit the last person in the world you think of is Hugo Hugs Gonzalez I yes. would say yes he's definitely not high risk high reward he's not high risk high reward low risk moderate reward yes that's that's Air. Hugo in a nutshell <laughs> yeah that's Hugo in a nutshell um, <laughs> yeah so if you guys <laughs> <laughs> if you if you um uh, don't smash, know who no? Kira is, he was really good in SoCal in bat 09 to yeah, and, and and quite good in teams too. I, um, yeah, um, from Irvine, so he plays with Mac D, Stab a lot. So yeah, Zoo, right? Yes, I think. Yeah, he played with Zoo a lot. Right. Oh, bad DI on that down smash. Okay, but Sheik is living. Yes, living.com. Ooh, the edge cancel. <laughs> A little bit, ah, uh, maybe just, okay, I was thinking like just needle him, like, I don't know. I guess I was, it's a tense situation where you got both the red team on your back. Yeah. I don't know how to explain this loosely, but like, sometimes there'll be like, a char two characters away from the, from Ken, and he'll just like tipper the guy that's two characters away. I've seen that, like, yeah. <laughs> And it's like the most like, raunchy like, tipper, raunchy. like, cause, cause you expect Ken to ha attack the person directly in front of him, right. but instead he attacks the person behind that guy. Right, 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 yeah, certainly, I've definitely seen him do that. Um, I mean, that was Marth's metagame back in the day. I mean, yeah. it was like uh, the, the different ways you could use forward smash. Yes. Marth, using a strong move in a effective way, it, it sounds like a good deal, right? Yeah. So, um, and, okay, he down smashed him. I don't, I don't think the oh, down smash would have killed. I don't think, oh, okay, that does kill. Yeah, stab is dead. Okay, blue Shouts team actually. Falco's link. Yeah, but shout outs to Kira holding it, holding it down. Yeah. With the stocks, yeah, that's gonna be death. Though. This is uh, one thing I love as Sheik. Sometimes I play against a team that has no check for my character. Uh, right, right, right. Yeah, Sheik. I mean, what is the check for your character? Isn't it really just Fox? It's pretty much a Fox and Falco, I guess, because Falco, you kind of have to bait for a hit, and right. teams, it really is hard to get a direct hit. What about like a really good Falcon? Um, like, how do you feel about like? You I know. shut down Falcon. It's, okay. it's just making sure Falcon's not running around. And right. And then you win, because that's how Falco Falcon gets his damage. Right. But uh, Kira's getting... Oh, Tipper. Yeah, that's uh, that's significant. That is a significant seat. Oh, my goodness. That was and a just like, well... I don't know how to call this. If they get a kill on Ken real quick... Yeah, nice. nice, I, nice I, I actually would rather be in blue team's position, even before those two stocks are right. going to be gone. Right. Wow. Kira falling asleep, caught slipping. Yes. And you know what they say. I, I if don't. I catch you slipping, I slap at you. And you be tripping. They, they don't say that. Yes. Be, huh? Gimmer has never heard that before. Gimmer yeah. from the East Coast. Um, All right. All right, and now we got a tight battle, one on one situation. Wow. The reflected missile lost to the uh, incoming missile. Hugs versus KBJ. Okay, ah, trying to go for that combo, but Hugs smashed the eyes out. Nice downer, but yeah, that he's working that okay. up out of shield. That was really smart to stab to not land on that platform, or he would have eaten a down down smash. Right. Um, so good awareness to jump. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to happen. All be. right, come on. Hugo comes from that era of janky Fox play. Yeah. And I, I, I don't think Falco's down throw even lets you do that, period. Yeah. I really like this. Um, uh, how do you feel about those reflectors? Um... Well, it's oh, not wow. really going to do much, but it might pr scare Hugs from doing future. Um, right. Oh, and he gets the... Ah, uh, okay, okay. He went for the uh, tech away with his down air. But I really like this play from Stab right now. You yeah. have definitely kind of... Oh, that won't kill. 
So like Stab has been nickel and diming him, getting a hit, running away, looking for an opening, get one hit, run away. Mm -hmm. I mean, well, that's winning the war of attrition against yeah. Samus. That's what you have to do because you're not well. That's not necessarily what you have to do, but you shouldn't expect more than that. You shouldn't expect to get a fat combo or something, or to be in her face all the time. Oh. Beautiful power shield. More power to stab. Yeah. Nice buffer roll to get oh, out of that situation. Oh, really nice. good grab there. Yeah. That was like almost max range. But Dreamland, as it turns out, is a big level, which means Samus is going to have increased survivability. That is a down smash you do not want to do, and I don't think he's going to do it again. Yeah, and Stab's been really good with his uh, pressure. He's not really getting up beat. Um, he's not really getting hit when he tries to approach. He's not. I what did I uh, what did I say? I thought I thought he wasn't going to do that down smash again, but he does, and he gets comboed. Well, punished for it. Yeah. Low risk, moderate reward. Shout out the life of Hugo Gonzalez in a nutshell. And the thing. <laughs> That huh? was crazy. That was incredible, an incredible comeback. And I'm sure I'm sure Akira's a little upset that you know he, he threw away that stock at zero, but you know it is what it is. That's gonna happen sometimes. You can't always get what you want. And uh, hugs with that composure. He was getting hit, 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 but he still waited. He played his game and he got the opening. He oh, wanted. that's hugs for you. Yeah. That's hugs for you. He made his paycheck off of beating Falcos in, back in the MLG yeah. days. Yeah, certainly. All right, they're uh, they're going to. I, I think this was the, the stage that I would have expected, Pokemon Stadium. Yes. Now I know Ken really does like this stage though, and uh, like Ken and Hooks, uh, game one against me and Zoo, they they actually struck here, which I thought was an interesting choice. Yeah. Um, I think Ken likes Ken and Isaiah loved um, the stadium. Yeah. It's a beautiful stage. It's it's oh, lush. Oh wow! It's did, you, did you see greenery. that shine? Oh, I no. did. I did. I was almost too enthralled with Stadium's beautiful emerald green pastures, but I did see that shine. And, dude, Kira and Stab are putting in work. They are. What did I tell you, dude? Yes. Okay. Um, Ken's going to struggle with this matchup. Um, see, Kira's not really one to, like, really overextend. He'll, he'll, he's really methodical in how he plays. Um, yeah. So I'm not sure. Wow, down smash. Ken oh, just working the really smash attack here. Okay. Um, well, that was good because he didn't let Sheik touch the ground. Yeah. I think it was between that or going for the tipper. And, uh, you know, if you're not 100% sure you can get that tipper, then... We have a we have a tree situation, but they're choosing to fight. They're opting to... They're opting to say F it. Oh. And seven stocks to four. This is not going either way. This is not... Well, it's going one of two ways. I'll it tell you is. that. It is. It is. I'm sadly mistaken. Yeah. Kareem BJ showing why he's really good. Uh, yes. That is exactly what we're being shown by this young Falco. This young gardening b-boying Falco. Up B's. Yeah, that's... You know, I noticed uh, Hugs uses up B a lot, even in teams. And even in situations where, like, he's not necessarily... It's, you know... It's low risk, but it's also very low reward. Like yeah. his teammates are not going to be able to combo off of it or anything. He just wants to reset the uh, reset the situation. And with that, like he, oh, Ooh. oh wow. The thing I don't really like about Hugo and teams is that you, you wait so long for that one like tilt for ten percent. Like it doesn't really lead to much. Right. Yeah. Yeah. He's he's all about minimizing risk. Yeah. He's not about that Daryl life. That Daryl life with the bombs and whatnot and powerful um, combos, yeah. Ooh, up smash, killing him off the top, looking like Fox McCloud. Looking more like his father. It's kind of funny because she could just like run at these characters and just gain space just from walking because like of how yeah. much like spatial threat he has on Marth and Samus. And Samus. Is Ken gonna be able to know? Yeah, good laser stab. Yeah. That was, that's that's that that's that that same uh, laser game that we saw from Bimbo Mexico last game. You know, using lasers to frustrate the opponents when they are trying to maybe get an edge guard or something on the uh, the teammate. I, I'm wondering something because I noticed that Stab likes to hold shield really for really long stretches and then roll. I'm wondering if Hugo and Ken can catch on to that when they um, pressure shield pressure. Um, yeah. Stab. It's um. But then it is frustrating. Right. And it's not the kind of thing you can react to necessarily. You kind of have to have a feel on it. You kind yeah. of have to know it's coming a little bit. 
Like, I feel like he's playing so safe right now, Stab is. Like, you can't directly hit him. Like, you're not going to space and hit him. You're going to have to bait him into something and then hit him after that. Right, right, right. And Blue Team takes that second game very convincingly over Ken and Hugs. Kira smiling. Shout outs to Kira. And Shout outs to Kira. He's trying to hit it pro in League of Legends. I hear. I think, yeah, I think he still is. He's That's a, uh, every every 20 year old male's dream. It's like a 16 year old dream now. Yeah, I guess so. There's a lot of a lot of a lot of young people, a lot of youth. Yes. All right. What kind of off center that oh. camera? But well, it doesn't matter now. Okay, the game's going. We're going into it. All right. Yeah. See, stab. Um, the thing about stab is he's got a very like safe playstyle. Yeah. Um, lots of lasers. Lots of lasers. And a lot of uh, dares that poke your shield, and he'll like fade back, so you won't get punished. Right. Just to keep himself safe and potentially base something out. So I mean. You've got to be a little intelligent in how you approach him, but if you're a character like Samus, you're you're mostly gonna have to kind of have to wait for him to come to you. Yeah, and uh, that leaves um that leaves Stab in a favorable position to frustrate Hugs when Kira is in these one-on-one -on -one situations with Ken, yeah, which I think we're seeing a fair bit. Because like you can see Stab make a minor mistake, Hugs will be like yes, and then get hit by Kira, and it's like oh, right, 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 right. And so that's why I feel like characters like Fox are so valuable in teams because they can create direct openings without really necessarily having to really bait too much. Right. They could just pressure directly, and so they don't have to wait for something. Yeah, that's big. A character like Sam is you really can't do much. Right. I mean, I guess you could stock tank and play support, but you're not the one that's going to find openings. Right. right. So we can already see their hand, Team Red. Oh gosh, and Hugo kills him. But they yeah. wanted to preserve that stock, and you could tell just based on how they were approaching it, or rather not approaching. Right, yeah. I mean, Samus is now at the percent where like you can expect her to die from any of the uh, stronger moves of either of these characters. Oh, Fox good. Good. The grab? Yeah, he has been he's been catching on to what we were talking about. He's, Stab just holds the shield really long. Right. Ooh. Okay, Stab wanted to kind of come in and help, but then he just, um, yeah. he realized he was just going to get... Oh, they're putting in work on Stab right now. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, the, uh, so like, in those situations where Samus gets the up off on one of them, it, um, it really just means that Ken, it, like, if Ken is doing well in, uh, his, his one-on-one, -on -one, or if he's in a position to combo off the up yeah. it's really good. Um, and otherwise, like, but uh, conversely, if the other blue team member that he's not up being has stage control, like, he himself risks getting hit. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, nice needles, but he's, yeah, he has to respect Ken coming in. This is going to be a long battle of attrition, like, just the way that um, both teams are handling this. Uh, yeah, the flow of the bashes. Yeah. I was about to say, Ken's not going to get that. Stab's really good at those angles. Right. Yeah, those were angles they didn't have back in the day. Yeah. They uh, they actually patched those patched those around 2007, 2008. Yeah. yeah. And then they had a geometry class, too. Right. Teaching teaching us. Really, it was just we all went to college, you know, yeah. so you know we had to take our prereqs. Yeah. Oh, and Ken dies. Yeah. Nice. And if he can, well, yeah, you can't really expect him to get the... Oh, and then Ken's Nair actually takes Hugo out. So now Blue Team has a slight yeah. lead. Um, they're just gonna oh, want to get some, get some straight hits in while they have. Uh, and what I'm kind of wondering, um, you know, they're at really high percentages. Is how does this team even get kills? Like red team? Yeah, like they have to like hard read something. I mean, right, nothing is nothing is super guaranteed. Like Falco living to 192 is completely unacceptable. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's that that's that unacceptable thing that your Asian dad gets mad at you for. Like son wise. Why is that Falco living to 192? Yes. Um, I'm kind of. Yeah, I know it won't happen, but it'd be kind of interesting if Ken decided to go Fox or something. But I know that. It's I fun. yeah, and also the game. I, I think the game is close enough that, that there's no yeah. real reason to. If he was getting like trunched, I I, I guess I could see it. Or possibly dumpster. Or possibly a dumpster might be enough to trigger that kind of situation. They really want to hold the stock. Yeah. <laughs> They're just like rolling away, just like trying to like use all their defensive options. Right. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Stab can't get can't get killed by that. Oh. Ooh. Caught Ken jumping there. Yeah. Oh, that was. Ooh. Really good. Okay. But didn't didn't get the nair that he wanted, but that's fine. Stab is gonna make it back. Ooh. Nice wave ledge. Oh, that was a really good reverse nair. Yeah. And we have a very even game. 
Hugs is going to want to stay really safe, really low risk. In this situation, you know, when you have a person... Ooh. Oh, okay, very nice. But that back air wasn't unrisky enough. Yes. Yeah. Didn't really come with rewards either. No, it didn't. Ooh. Gets the combo going on Ken. Oh my goodness, is he going to shine him off the top? No? Oh, uh, no, he's the West Balls. Yeah. West Balls would have... He would have done something. Ah, okay, I was going to say you can't do that. Because Stab could have just down smashed or whatever <laughs> killed him. Way to go, Kira. Oh, what the heck? Falco clearly needing to work on his uh, flexibility there. Those splits aren't cutting it. He needed the channels in Isaiah there to beat the one on two. Ken, Ken yeah. yeah. And I mean, there's also the, just the fact that Marth is not as good as the fast fallers. Yeah. I think, you know, in those situations, what's what's Marth going to do to every, like, Marth's, all of Marth's moves are out and then they're, then yeah. then he's punishable for a long window. What's so he going to do? Fair them to 230 or whatever it is? Th that too, yeah. yeah. And I mean, even when he does a fair, like even if he hits one of the te the blue team members, he's vulnerable for the remainder of that fair. Right. So they back go back to, to battlefield. battlefield. B T B F, B two B F. Yeah. I I really think you know Team Red like you have a Marth. Like I think they need to go for more scrambles um, instead of this uh, over one v one. Like I think they're playing too much one v one right now. This right. Is, this isn't 07 where you can get away with that. Really, you think you think Marth needs to be. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I guess I can see that. Yeah. I mean, uh, un unless, unless the one v unless whoever was one v oneing stab was like solidly killing him, yeah. which doesn't really seem to be the case at all. Then, um, then yeah, I certainly agree. Like with even that. stab is winning most of these one on one exchanges, or he's not really getting hit. Whereas right. He's he's staying at a really nice spacing and 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 just poking with lasers. Yeah. You know, to keep himself safe. Like and like Kira is just winning his one v one situations. Like no matter who he's playing right now. And I think when that's the case, you start, you have to start fighting, forcing uh, 2v2s and 2v1s. Right. Ooh, that tipper is going to take it. And Ken. Oh, they're they're up now. Yeah. Ken doing really well right now. Ooh, this could... Ah, uh, okay, okay. But I, I really like it when um, Hugo and Ken are playing a lot closer to each other as opposed to, like, one group going to the right st side and one going to the left. Like, Ken's, like, a lot playing a lot closer to where Hugo is. Right. Like, like I mean, not always, but whenever they can. They're, they're playing a little bit closer. All right. Yeah, that, uh, that laser pressure is working on Ken. It's going to make him... Conditioning him into being, you know, afraid to shield grab. Well, I say that, but he still does it. Oh, Ooh. the really smart new Kira is coming. It was either that or he was trying to tip uh, the, the tech in place. Yeah. I, actually, I suspect that was it, but yeah. Um, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah nice. that was nice from uh, nice from Davey Dave, Kira. I love playing Sheik against these characters. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm sure you do. I feel the exact same way. All right. So they're they're playing around each other and they're protecting each other for the most part a lot better than the last game. Right. All right. And Ken is off the stage with a nice, and he goes uh, he goes low enough to get yeah, the edge guard. That's, that's, that's a free edge guard when Marth's that low. Right. Um, the only way you can get out, I think, is by preemptively up being. Right. It's more of a read yeah. kind of thing. This is really close. Yeah, yeah. There's a. Uh... Oh my goodness. There right. the, yeah. No, Kira getting that grab is significant. See, blue team's got slightly better stage control now. Yeah. That's oh, wow. And dash tag kills yeah. off the top. Okay. At that point, I think Kira recognized after the first grab that he wasn't going to kill off a down throw anymore. Right. Like, he goes too high. Yeah. <laughs> That's such a weird thought to me. Down throw not comboing on yeah. Samus. All right. My, oh wow. Okay. I was going to say he might be living. Uh, but I was sadly mistaken. Oh wow, uh, that that uh, s that laser electrifying stun stopped Hugo from down smashing. Yeah. Ooh, that's gonna be big. Uh, uh, you well, know, it's still really close. Yes. I would rather be in blue team's position right now because if Marth dies and Hugo's are, Hugo's already at near death. Yeah, and Marth is about to die. I think. I don't think. And now Hugo's at death percent. So yeah. Yeah, and now blue team is looking good, looking to take this set 3-1. You know, in this situation, I wouldn't even be bothered going for um, Hugo. I'd rather just double team Ken because they know that Hugo has to stay back. Right. Like, just rack up the damage on Ken as much as you can. Uh, really good forward smashes. Yeah. Ken's landing. Ooh. Wow, and red team clutches it out. Ken pumping his fists in victory.
Ken's had a lot of uh, forward smashes all down this round. Yeah. That's important. I mean, if you hit them, you're going to be looking good. And if you miss... I, I think he has to go for it, though. In this, With these character matchups, they have no way of killing them. They don't have gu guaranteed kill setups. Yeah, on, they yeah. don't. Yeah. Um, so I think he has to throw it out. Um, or else they're going to be living to 180. Right. Every, every That's life. incredibly undesirable. Now, Hugo's probably going to be reminiscing about life, putting on chapstick, drinking water, right. meditating. Right. So this eating, his own meal, eating his own meal. Unwinding. Hugo, Hugo, the kind of man that will that will answer uh, oatmeal to the question, "What is your favorite cereal?" Yes. Yeah. And Ken, just looking back, <laughs> looking back to his his glory days, digging deep. What did I used to do versus those those Falcos that that uh, that D A Dave Falco and that he, luciferous Sheik? It's all about the grab game. It's all about the grab game. That's right. It is all about the grab game. Whoever gets grabbed first, it's probably gonna lose that stock. Yes. Um, now this is where that champion mojo comes in because this is game five, and this decides who makes it out of the pool. I think I think Stab and Kira have no no lack of champion mojo themselves though. R low risk, moderate reward. reward. That's right. That's right. Good good stuff. Whoever that was, I didn't catch your name, but that was exactly yeah. exactly the kind of man that that Hugs is seeking to be in this game five situation. Yes. In this set that determines the escapees of this pool. Escapees or escapers? Um, don't know. Escapees. Yeah. Escapees. It sounds like escapees, so I like that sound. Yeah, I love peanut butter. Um, oh. oh, Ken going. Yeah, that's that. Five. Yeah, that's that. I, I, that's that. That's the the three piece Ken special. He does the four hit side B, which is a little tricky to punish. So he does the up B to the top platform, and then if and then if you miss the timing on that, you get countered. Yeah. It's three piece Ken special. I've seen. It. Look at look at his uh, his videos from the last Kings of Cali. He'd be doing that. Yes. Straight up. Scar. Yeah. All right. So Stab has traditionally not done well on last games of the set. Really? Yeah. So I want to see if, like, maybe that, that all that time with the flowers like helped him like meditate and relax. Mm -hmm. That he's got to channel that that Zen. Yes. Okay. All right. That was a really bad down down smash by Kira. I think that was a desperation. Yeah. Um, Ooh, Ken catching with the Naren, sending to his death. Slicing and icing birds. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Nice work from Ken. Reverse Ken combo. I think Ken's feeling himself. The moment he went for that side B, like I was like, okay, Ken has like that like swagger confidence. That Ken that O4 swag. Yeah. I mean, you can't even really pin it down as like O4 swag. Like Ken was, you know, dominant for a much longer period than. If I were Hugo right now, I would just get out of the way, play support, and let Ken have six stocks to work with. Sure. I mean, but well, I, I mean, I, I'm sure Hugs is feeling good too, though. I mean, yeah. you know, he's got, he's got a. Uh, he he's been playing well this game, you know, and I think he. Dude, he goes into. Ooh. He just did an up B. A, a, a shield breaker and a floor smash. That's so Randy. Yeah. But it works. He knew it was going to work. It, yeah, it works unless the opponent's got really good timings on their punishes. Yeah. And it's just hard to, you know, hard to punish on reaction because you don't expect that kind of stuff to happen. Yeah. Good lasers by Stab because yeah. um, Hugs was fiending for um, punishing Kira there for fiending. the round. He was thirsty. Nice. Nice uh, forward air from right. Kira. Kira's going in right now. Ah, oh, he can't get the kill on Kenda. Yeah. Hugo's um, good at kind of like scaring him off. Walling out the, uh, yeah. yeah. And Ken's been playing really Oof. good. Yeah, but he gets, he finds that, uh, finds that forwarder though. Yeah. And now this is looking fairly close again. It's a clear one stock lead by Team Red if you look at it. Yeah, too. I'd say so. Ooh. Now those reads are coming in. He went for the grab. He went for Side high risk. Grab. High risk, high reward. Moderate reward. Yeah. Un-Hugo like. Un-Hugo like, but I mean, he knows he's got a, a stock advantage to play with here. Now, Two Stab, stocks now. Stab needs to not lose composure here. I mean, he's had some early deaths. I mean, he's still approaching, so it's showing that he still has confidence, but he needs to not lose he doesn't, composure. Yeah, and he shouldn't overextend either. Yeah. Some people were like, if they get gimped, they want to go like, I want to make it even, and then right. they blindly approach and die. And, and they approach the same, often they approach the same person that uh, killed them. That killed them, yeah. All right, so is Stab going to get this edge guard? No. no. Yes. Oh, he could have got the ledge. He was a little slow on that. One. I don't. I, I just didn't think he was aware that Ken could do that. Right. Yeah. He probably didn't see it coming. Yeah. But you have to. You have to know. You have to be able to. You, you have, have to, to cover that. Credit. Yeah. You have like, to cover it. Because why not? And and Dan, Kira clearly had stage control. There was no reason to, you know, to to not get the ledge. Hugs yeah. was at bay. At this point, you know, like not to be rude. Um, 
I, I, I really okay, Ken, that doesn't work. Okay. Okay, Ken. You, okay, Ken and has left the opening there. Uh, but I don't know. They're just playing with such confidence, and you can kind of just see it by the way they're playing. Such yeah. bravado. Yes. Hugo Bravado Gonzalez, yes. they call him. All right. Oh, what, what was, was that? that? I, 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 I doubt it was a timber down smash. I think it, he it was a crouch cancel timber down smash. Yeah, from Mark. that's amazing. That's what it was. I thought it looked like a down tilt, but down tilt doesn't suck you that way. Yeah. Down. Oh my gosh. And a Ken combo to well. Oh, yeah. and he not 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 to not to wrap <laughs> it up, but um, dang, he just ordered his Chipotle, but he didn't want to order it to go and wrap things up. He didn't. I sure that's one way to describe right. the situation that just occurred. Yes. Yeah. Maybe not my choice of how. Okay. <laughs> and hugs wrapping it up. 3-2 over Kira and stabbed by a hippie. Okay. Great. That, that championship composure. Yeah, that mojo. They've that seen that. Mojo Jojo. Mojo Jojo.